of inspiration. I'm Jeff Molnar from Star 98.3. This is where we take things off of our Pinterest page, attempt to do them, and hopefully inspire you to give them a try as well. Uh, this week you guys picked DIY bath crayons, which I think will be a fun one for the kids. Uh, what you need is some gl clear glycerin soap base, some food coloring, a measuring cup, and then a mold. I'm just using an ice cube tray. You can find a mold that shaped more like a crayon, but I'm, by all means, go for it. But this is what we're going to use today. Uh, first step is you have to just cut up your uh, glycerin soap base. Uh, I got this at Michael's. It was a little pricey. It's about $16, but if you pay full price at Michael's, you're kind of a sucker. My friend Pauline taught me that. Uh, all you be, they have tons of coupons online and on their website. I got this for 50% off, so it costs only 8 bucks in the end, which isn't too bad if you already have the food coloring. You just want to get that out of the mold. And it's already kind of perforated, so you just want to cut along the lines. Okay, I've taken my cubes of the glycerin soap base. You want to put them in the microwave in short bursts, and each color for your crayon you're going to do individually. I've got three colors here. We've got blue, green, and red. Uh, you put the dye in after you've melted it, but you want to do short bursts in the microwave. So I'm just going to throw that in there, kind of 20, 30 seconds at a time. And it's melted. Okay, once it's melted, that's when you start adding the food color. I'm going to start with blue and just kind of do one drop at a time until you get to the color you want. And you just pour it into your mold. Now we play the waiting game. So let's just leave it out at room temperature until it's almost firm, and then you can place it in the freezer to kind of speed up the hardening process. So it says it can take anywhere from 30 minutes to three hours. That's a long time range. I'm gonna give it a half hour, see how it feels then. It's been about a half hour. They are now hard, but you want them to get super hard. They're still kind of a little jelly right now. I'm gonna throw them in the freezer for about another hour or two, and then they'll be hard enough for us to actually use as crayons. It's been a couple hours. They should be hard now. They feel pretty hard. Let's take them out and see how they look. They look pretty hard. I guess now we just have to see if they work. Do they actually draw like crayons? Got my bath crayons, I'm in the bath. Got my water wings for safety. You never want to drown in the bathtub. The question is, will they write? Let's see if we can write on the wall here. That's not writing. I think I just made colored soap. It's not really writing at all. Um, I don't know what I could have done differently. Maybe it's just something that doesn't work that you see on Pinterest. Hopefully uh, next week we actually get something that actually works. I'm Jeff Boulder from Star 98.3. Thanks for watching Pinspiration. You can follow Star on Pinterest at 983 Star FM. You can follow me on Pinterest at Jeff Molnar. Now excuse me, I have to take a bath. <laughs>